past them. <laughs> nice wheels. You coming down the bay later? They got a few bands on. I'd like to, but I can't. I've got to take my grandfather to Arbor. Edward! I thought you'd gone. I thought you'd gone and left me. I, I can't seem to do up this. I can't manage. It must be my arthritis. It's hot, Grandad. Uh, you won't need it. Uh, we got to go. Don't worry, girls. I'll bring him back in one piece. <laughs> <laughs> Wait up, partner. Why today, Grandad? What? Well, we could have picked any day to go. Why today? Hey, I'm letting you drive my car, aren't I? Only because they've taken your license. Careful, you're over revving again, John. I'm Ed, Grandad. Edward. John's my dad. What have you got there, Grandad? Nothing for you to worry about, something I have to do. Is that why I'm driving you all this way? To deliver a letter? What's wrong with the stamp? I need to do something while I can still remember. It's not a woman, is it, Grandad? A woman? Yeah, the letter you're taking. What letter? Right inside pocket. Who was that girl back at the house? What girl? Brunette. Pretty smile, curves in all the right places. Hannah. You mean Hannah? You can't talk about her like that. She's just some girl from college. She likes you, you know. Mary Harris. I had a thing about her when, when I was about your age. Didn't have the courage. Come on. The car should have cooled by now. We've got to get there by sundown, John. I'm Ed, Grandad. Where are we going, John? Out west, to Arbor. Remember? I'll show you how to skim pebbles, if you like. Skim pebbles? You've already showed me, Grandad, when I was six. Abba. Abba. I used to live near there, you know. I know. The wrecking race. The what? The wrecking race. It's a challenge. A swimming race. Mary Harris. Mary Harris? That girl you liked. Is that who the letter's for? She's probably... We had to swim out this marker and back again. Difficult against the tide. The first half of the race went smoothly and... I could do with a cuppa. I'm just going to pay a visit. said you wouldn't leave me. I wouldn't do that, Grandad. I'm not leaving you, Grandad. I'd never leave you. You're leaving me. John. John's my dad's name. Stop calling me that. I'm sorry, sorry, Ed. I'm sorry. Look at me. It won't be long now before some nurse will want to wipe my bum every morning. You won't want to know me then. I will, Grandad. I will.
Are we really here to skim pebbles? Can't we just deliver the letter and go home? There it is, about 200 yards out. Can you see it? The old wrecking race, a swimming race. They used to hold it every year, the first Sunday of August. The first Sunday? That's the day. Come on! <laughs> what happened, Grandad? Well, I reached the marker, all right, just behind the leading pack. And when I turned to come home to base, there she was. Mary Harris, cheering from the beach. I didn't have the guts to talk to her, but I knew that if I could win, she would be mine. Did you win? About 50 yards out, I seized up. I did everything I trained not to do. I had nothing left. A lifeguard had to fish me out in front of everyone. And Mary Harris? Went off with a lifeguard. <laughs> Come on, boy! I need to prove I can do it! What? What, now? Now! <laughs> The letter, Grandad. Is it for Mary Harris? No, oh, it's for you, Ed. It's for you. <laughs> Wake up, partner. My dearest Ed, please remember this day for us both, Grandad. <laughs>